Other Bunches, Part 2. A Hammer Blow. A Hammer Blow is a punch that could either be striped to a person that already slightly lower, about here, boom. Or it could even be struck straight forward, like we do in defense against choke from the rear when we come in and strike down there. Okay? Base, let's start from the beginning of it. So, if you strike with your left hand, your left foot be forward, target will be in front of your belt. So it's not really in front, it's off to the side. You're gonna rise, turn, and strike. As you strike, you're going to drive down body mass with the punch. So again, one, ha, one, ha. If you do it from the right side, it will be easier if you switch your hands and do one, ha, one, ha. You can practice this to here, ha. You can practice it to here as well. It's good to know how to do this punch both low and up. And you should obviously work on them both. So this is your hammer blow. So we're going to back of the hand punches. Back of the hand punching punches is just it's the same surface contacting as the whipping punches. Right now I have an individual who stands over to my right hand side. What I'm gonna do from here is I'm gonna confirm visual to the target. I'm gonna change my stance simply by changing my feet. I'm gonna rise the elbow and strike and come standing in front of him. So again, it is one, one. One, ha, ah. one, ha. Ah. If you want to see it standing in this direction, it is one, he, one, he, one, he. If you want to see it with a little bit more speed, it is one, boom, one, boom, one, Obviously, same thing cannot go to the other foot because if I have to turn in that direction, I cannot just pivot. I actually have to take the foot and adjust my stand. So, for the left hand side, I go one, and I'm going to come back one. But I still first confirm the target, then step low the elbow, power the punch, and I come back to protect and back. So one more time. One, yeah. One, yeah. One, yeah. One, yeah. One. Let's take those punches and add a spin to them. Okay? Here's your strike with the left. Here's your strike with the right. Yes. Here's your footwork. Eyes to target, hands protected, leg is moving all forward, eyes are still spotting, eyes are still spotting. Eyes catching from the other side, foot adjust, hand comes in and hit. It will be important that your chest still forward and you are indeed in foundation. One more time, smooth. I go hop, east, boom. Hop, east, boom. This is from the left side, so some of you have no excuse because you are righties. Take your Right foot, foot, put it forward. It's the leading hand that hit. 
And you're going to do the same step. One, eyes are spotting, eyes are catching, hands are up. You already hit and you are in foundation. He, again, one. He, boom. And one, he, boom. Sometime when I work with the kids, I ask them to do this step in reverse. Because if they do it in reverse, it's hard, it's easier for them to grasp this footwork. You might want to do it as well. If you're okay with your left and your right, you should comfortably start to work these punch into your strikes in a more comfortable way that maybe eventually you can add it into your combinations. After all, it's a good punch to have. It comes from a weird angle and it's hard to see. So it's surprising to a lot of people. Also, a lot of time you can overextend and miss and kind of throw balance forward to some degree, have an opponent slipping over to your right and you can just boom and catch him right from the other side just by adding a couple of light easy steps. So it is a good punch to have, it is a good punch to work on. I hope you'll spend time perfecting it. I hope you come back and maybe nail a couple of people with this too. That's going to be fun. In any case, I hope you enjoyed today's class. Thank you.